at a young age, I was reading this article um, about Mike Francisco Dream, and on the top of the, the article, on top of the interview, it said, dream but don't sleep. So after I read that and, you know, was influenced and inspired by his work, I knew it was like time to hustle. So Hanabata Blitz is a collection of works that I've been working on for the past maybe two years. And it just focus, focuses more on uh, tradition, culture, and striking hard with it. I played on those two words, Hanabata Blitz, Craig. So Hanabata is um, a local term made up by the plantation uh, workers that meant actually boogers. But um, within time, uh, they used it more as uh, a term saying back in the Hanabata days. So back in the days, back in, the, back in my younger days. So I took that term, chopped it up, and created uh, kind of like my own term for it, like uh, more, more so focusing on tradition and culture. Uh, Blitzkrieg is a German word that means uh, strike like lightning or um, lightning war. And what I wanted to do was strike hard with, um, with culture and tradition. Bash, pound, and smash, knocking out the competition punch. Kick, submit, whatever it takes to win these. Thrusting to the body when the elbow hits trapped. Oh, so now you'll never escape the clinch drop. Down for no count, you best defend yourself, survive. Where you find the minimal possibilities to slow down the attack. The enemy is weak back. Up on your feet, now who's the predator? Straight from your second when you're fully focused, knowing that it's war by the ringing of the bells you receive. But the stars that have disappeared, it's making man into be a fire in the eyes of a warrior. They hear the beat of rage and the nature to destroy. Let them feel the heat and pose as you set the pace to clash. Lighter on the toes, heavy in the hands as you work around the jab. Then a devastating combination touches you the land. I gotta die for your uppercut, strong for your shot attempt, slip for your underhook. So, um, Hanabana Blitzkrieg, uh, I took that word and kind of deconstructed it and reconstructed it to mean something different for me. Uh, Hanabana meant more like tradition or culture um, and striking hard with it. So, I wanted these pieces uh, for the show to represent um, more culture, more tradition, more roots, um, and kind of focus on why we do the things we do um, and why we paint the way we paint. So working on this project, I realized that the patterns from the past have um, paved the way for me today. So basically, I just want to pay respects to the people who came before me. Just like Mike Francisco Dream said, dream but don't sleep.